Malia was involved in a car accident on April 5th of 2008, and she was severely injured. They flew her down to the University of Iowa hospitals, where she had multiple internal injuries, broken bones, and most seriously, head and brain trauma. She had a broken pelvis. Most every bone in her face was broken. Her teeth were knocked out. Uh, she had a broken leg. She had a broken wrist. She lost a kidney. They kept her in an induced coma. They would test it every so often in the mornings and see if her reactions and her responses were coming around. And I will never forget the day that they were trying to take her blood pressure and she kept squirming around. And they said, Malia, you need to hold still. And she looked up at us and said, I can't. Those were the first words since the accident. Word went out like wildfire throughout the hospital. Malia spoke, Malia spoke, and we had doctors coming down from the pediatric intensive care unit. She spent um, a whole month in the intensive care unit just to get over the acute injuries. At that point, we still weren't sure how well she will live afterwards. We knew she will survive it, but we weren't sure what quality of life she would have. And she proceeded to really make remarkable strides forward and uh, improve. Uh, and as she improved, her real personality started coming out. It was very exciting for us. They saved my life, and I'm very grateful that they did that. And I like to go back and visit them. And I just want to make sure that they know that I'm grateful. If you could write a story, and for as bad as it was, it couldn't have turned out any better in the end. Going from whether or not she's going to be able to open her eyes, to whether she'd ever talk, to ever walk, or even have any capacity at all to where she is today, she's just a, a walking miracle. They saved our daughter's life. She has a second chance at life, and she completes our family. And she, she wouldn't have made it if we did not get her down to the university, and they did everything possible. Every department did everything possible to save her life. And we have her with us again. And if it wasn't for them, having the best of the best working with her to make her the person that she is today, we, we just had the best outcome that any of us could have ever asked for. When we prayed at night, we prayed that she would return to us 100%, and she has and that's thanks to the university. Changing medicine, changing kids' lives.